previously on Reg and Crane. But now don't ever do anything like that again without me or backup. You could have been killed. Douglas Crane? Yeah. And I'll tell you everything. Gavin Smith is looking at a large amount of property here in Catonsville. You think I'm in on this? You tell me. And I'm going to tell him everything. Okay, we'll see about this. Not my day. What happened to you? Car explosion. Your car? No. Thank God it wasn't mine. <laughs> Pay attention, asshole. I got a call to meet with somebody who's gonna give me info regarding the missing drugs and Carly. Carly? What does she have to do with it? I don't know. Anyway, I got to the location. I had a check for a thousand dollars. I got to the car that he was supposed to have been in. They signaled me, and right when I'm walking toward it, it blew up. Mama Mia. So what we know so far, Carly, the former DA, asked us to investigate this drug case involving Leon Scully. At the same time, property in Kingsville is being bought by one, Gavin Smith, and two, whoever he's working with. This is the signature of the property. Wow. So Gavin really did buy that property with the money. But the question is, who was working with him in Maryland? And how was Carly connected? Right. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Dude, really? Pulling from Texas? Porn. What, you don't like it? Man, I told you about my past with the ladies, man. Ladies are like beer at the end of the day. It tastes mmm, mmm, good. Damn right. Oh, look at the thighs on that, though. Whoa. Whoa. Wait a minute. Son of a... Where'd he go? Hi. Is this Candy? Hey, this is Rich. Dude, are you trying to go to jail? Get off the damn phone and get to work. I'll be back. What was this? You lied to me. You told me you were you weren't in town on business, and you, and you, and you claim you didn't even know Gavin Smith. Don't. Look at the signature. Look at that handwriting. Gavin. Wrong on. I've been involved with you and Gavin before when y'all signed papers. This is your handwriting, Patrick. You're working for Scully. Answer me! All right. Gavin signed over to Dummy Corporation. 
with the drugs to transfer to Scully. Scully had the money for Gavin for property in Catonsville. Gavin got greedy, wanted more money, blackmailed Scully with something he had over him. What? What's that? He had me looking to, had me looking to Scully, his connection to the former DA. Carly? Right. Good God, Patrick. What have you done? Where is Gavin Smith right now? Is he dead? Hello, Mr. Maxwell. Yeah, this is Reginald Spinelli, at your service, sir. Yeah, I'd like to place an order today. Yeah, how much are your diamond, your 12 karat diamond rings? I think I have the hats for Carly. Spinelli can never know the truth. Sir. Give me another one. Make it a big one this time. I don't get it, Patrick. I don't get it. Why would you get involved in this? You don't owe Gavin Smith anything. And why, why would Leon contact you? You never even met him or Carly until recently, I guess. I had to protect someone. Who? Reginald Spinelli. Spinelli? The Italian tech geek. You know him? He's my new partner on this case. How do you know him? He's my brother. Stay tuned for scenes for the next Reg and Crane. Next on Reg and Crane. Spinelli is going to be crushed. You have to tell him. Not until Scully's behind bars. And you can't either. I'm not going to lie to him. Better start. My partner's a liar. What are you babbling about? Leon Scully. We gotta talk. What the? We have nothing to say to each other. I think you wanna do that. 